All right, hello and welcome back. We are back in the land of summons, and um, we just got through a really, really tough dungeon. So it's time to explore what this town has to offer us. Um, seems that everyone, everyone loves Rydia quite a bit. <laughs> this is the library. It holds knowledge beyond our imagination. The history of the humans in brief, it's brief compared to the land of summons. Summon magic. A type of magic used to call forth monsters in times of need. Only a few still hold this power. Only those with great physical and mental strength may enter the cave that leads to the world of humans. Titan, shaker of earth. Titan's power rips through the earth, tearing open an abyss so wide as to swallow any and all. Ifrit, spawn of flame. Ifrit's flame has the power to incinerate all in its path. It is said that there are other forms of summon magic that still lie undiscovered. Ramu, the god of the good elder. Ramu's wrath. Ramu's wrath calls forth dark clouds that condemn enemies with bolts of lightning. Shiva, queen of ice. Those who anger Shiva will instantly tran will be instantly transformed into statues of ice. Chocobo, the cutest of all summons, and the first to flee from battle. This book is so moving. Shh, this is a library for crying out loud. Naming way? How the hell did you get here? This guy, like, he's relentless. She guards the path that leads to her husband, the king of summons. Only those who can surpass her power may behold the king's true form. King of Summons, his ruler of the of the vast ocean, he appeared one day from the northern sea. His powers are without equal in this land. Odin, master of the blade, his only defeat occurred when his sword was struck by a bolt of lightning. Zensetsuken, his ultimate attack, annihilates any enemy with a single blow. Laws of the land of summon. True strength lies only in the souls of the righteous, and one must prove their worth to attain it. What happened in the past? What does the future hold? Life is an eternal mystery. If scan fails to indicate the nature of a monster, you may wish to consult the bestiary. Long, long ago, a giant whale descended the earth from the moon. Presently, it is in a deep sleep within the dragon. God of Summons created us and watches over us from afar, never having known defeat. Perhaps the only way to defeat him is to reflect his own strength against him. Two moons. In the ancient sky, the two moons were one, so it is written. Do you have literature in your world, too? I sure do. Alright. This is the royal chamber. You must receive permission from Queen Asura before you may approach the king. Queen Asura! Rydia, dear, what brings you back to us? We need your help. Very well, but first you must prove your worth. That is the way of things here. Alright, well... Something tells me I'm probably not ready to fight them yet. I'm gonna go ahead and... Finish my shopping first. I see you can't meet the king without defeating Queen Asura first. People say my brethren get up to no good when they visit different worlds. That's true, that's true. I wonder if humans have the skills to wield our weapons. Hey, it's Rydia! Okay, let's see. We have so much money. We have so much money.
Maybe I should buy another ko Kotetsu. Yeah, I should probably do that. Let's do it. Okay, another Kotatsu. Yeah, double Kotatsu. Suddenly he's not looking so bad. You know, the fact that he can dual wield weapons is actually quite significant, it looks like. I am not looking to stay the night at that rate. Titan's got nothing if you cast Float. Chocobo, Shiva, Ramu, they all live here. How's Ifrit? Still hot-headed? That's a, that's a kick. It's one kek from me. All right. I'm going to save once more now that I'm done shopping. And just double checking. Everyone is at full. Okay. Let's fight Queen Asura. This might be a bad idea, though. Let us begin the test. All right. Wow. Okay, let's throw a shuriken. Jump. What? Is Edge just, like, actually that much weaker than everyone else? I mean, I get that he's, like, a way lower level, but... Still... Yeah, like, he is just... I wonder if Pin does anything. I bet it doesn't, but I'm going to give it a shot anyway.
All right, he's dead. life on herself, which was really interesting. Edge is so weak. I didn't think this fight would be, like, easy. Okay, that was not worth it. I wasn't really going to use those weapons anyway, but, uh... But the damage was just certainly not there. I should be casting Protect on, on Edge. That's what I should be doing. You know what? I'm going to cast Protect on him now because he's going to be protected by Cecil. It actually might be better for him to just be this low, because then he doesn't take bigger hits, right? Yeah. Oh my god. That was kind of a, a cool fight. That was a brutal fight. Like, she was a relentless attacker. You have proven your worth, Rydia. You may summon me whenever you desire. Rydia learned Asura. You've proven your worth, Rydia. You may summon me whenever you desire. You are the first to defeat Asura, but you cannot overcome evil with strength alone. Strong spirit required... Strong spirit is required to steer one's power towards righteousness. Will you test your spirit against mine? Okay. Okay, so that was the warm-up. All right, Cottage, save. Now it's time to fight. So he lied. He was the king. He's like, I'm just some old man. I'm like, all right. Okay, let's do this. Okay, I'm going to take that as Ramu is weak, or Leviathan is weak to Thunder.
Suddenly Edge is like actually doing real damage. Should I reflect Rydia? I'm doing it. I'm doing it. I'm going for it. All right, well, I guess next I'm going for a high potion here. That was really bad. Okay. Well, Phoenix down. Ramu. I I just have to go for this Kiraga here. Okay. Well, it's good to know that Riddy is um, Shell is there, so I wasn't wasting moves at least. Thundaga yet? No. Okay, please, please don't reflect. Okay, thank goodness. Must be getting close. Really don't need a dry ether just yet. Thinking pretty soon Rydia needs a dry ether though. Casted Shell at a very good time. Okay, Rydia needs this ether. I used an ether, even though I probably should have just used a dry ether. It's like probably fine. Yeah, I didn't even need the ether. All right. Felt like we just had a really good rhythm going there. Indeed, your spirit is righteous. I, Leviathan, King of Summon, shall serve you. Rydia has learned Leviathan.
Wow. Okay. Cast Tsunami, which deals major damage to all enemies. All right. Well, <laughs> I think I think that is going to do it for this part. I'm going to go ahead and use a cottage after that fight to get back to full. And uh yeah, that what a what a heck of a set of battles. That was really fun. Um I probably could have done them at a little lower of a level. I you know, doing them around level 40, that felt about right. But um, certainly those could be done at a slightly lower level. But uh, yeah, that was that was a ton of fun. Um, so yeah, I will see you all in the next part um, where I am gonna go probably just do some cleanup, turn in this rat's tail, and and explore more around the map before we go and finish the final dungeon. Um, so yeah, I will see you all for that. Make sure to like and subscribe if you like the content. Um, leave a comment down below telling me if uh, there's something else you want to see. And yeah, I will see you in the next one. Peace.